All it takes is one dog. One dog. Guys, I thought I would bring you to a cemetery today. One of the prettiest cemeteries I've ever seen. And I'm up here right now. But since we rolled in, there's a dog here. And my dog right back there, which we have her with us, sometimes could be a nuisance. So we're going to roll back there. Maybe, just maybe, I might be able to get out. I don't know where this dog went. But if it comes up near Stormy, there's going to be a fight. Because my dog is a nuisance. Okay, as I do this video, I'm going to have to keep my eyes peeled for that dog. <laughs> as that dog comes, we got to get Stormy in the car and take off. If not, the dog comes up to Stormy, it's going to be a fight. And I, yeah. All it takes is one dog where we go. But anyway, I am in Patriot Cemetery, guys. East View Patriot Cemetery. I've done video up here before, but it's been a couple years. And what's funny is, I probably started the video off the way I started it now. I had to correct myself because no sooner I turned the camera off, that's when Angie said, East View Patriot Cemetery. And I guarantee that's the way the last video was started off. But guys, this is one of the most unique graveyards I'll let you guys see behind me I've ever seen. It is so peaceful here. So freaking beautiful. I've even said, if I ever pass away, I might like to be buried here. As you can see behind me, and I've said this before in my, my videos when I was here last, there's a farm. There's a farm behind me. And the one time we did come up here, the first time we came up here, there was no graves in this area then. Now that was about, ooh, I'm guessing maybe 10 years back. 10 years ago was the first time we came here. It was absolutely no graves then. We're gonna walk down here a little bit. I'm also gonna get some video footage of the car driving by, which you guys already seen that. And I'm trying to keep my eyes peeled. Of course, Stormy had to have a bowel movement. And my wife's like, you want me to pick it up? And I was like, well, yeah. Then she kind of had that smirk on her face. I said, well, not only you get to pick it up, you get to double bag it too. I am very, very lucky my wife will pick that up when I'm doing my video work. Yeah, but my gosh. I'm going to turn around on this next clip and let you see some open land. Tonight, I might look into switching this over and having both the microphones working. That way I can turn the camera around and still talk and I won't be muffled. Yeah, my other mod did not do that. For some reason, this mod is, but look at that open land back there. My gosh, see, I want to take you guys over to the older part. That's where my wife's grandmother is buried. We may end up doing that before we leave the before we leave the cemetery. So far, we haven't ran into that dog, and I got one more video shot to do with the car coming in. <laughs> but guys, my gosh, this place is so peaceful. It is the most unique cemetery I've ever seen up to date, and I've seen them all. Well. Not all. Can you see that cobweb right there? Look at this. This is a cobweb. Crazy, huh? My wife has a great-grandmother buried here. And this is where she's leaving flowers. And my car is parked right in the middle of the road because there's really nowhere to pull off the park. But nobody's up here well, except that dog. And my eyes are peeled for that dog. 
I haven't seen it yet except when we first came in and when we set it over yonder there. That's when I seen it. I'm gonna do a full pan around. But guys, I tell you what, don't like to talk about the day I pass away, but this is where I think I might want to be buried. It is so beautiful. And I got that cobweb on my arm and it's tickling me. <laughs> There's a creek right down there. And right over that way is the Ohio River. And behind me right now is nothing but woods. Dense woods. But my God, this place is so beautiful. Like I said before, it's quite unique. And right on the other side there is another creek. Yeah. On the way up here, I told Ange, I was like, we should come up here and check out the fishing for spring up here. Yeah, it's been that long. Uh, at least I'm guessing, I don't know, maybe four or five, maybe seven, maybe even more years than that. It's been a while since we've been here last. And I was telling Ange on the way in, I was like, I hope it still has this charm. Well, guess what? It does. I was going to do a fishing trip today, y'all. But I decided, now nah, I'm done. I'm done. Maybe something might happen. Maybe I might have one of them days. But right now, I think it's time to go to hiking mode only. And the reason I wasn't able to do anything today, this morning, like I wanted to, was we had somebody supposed to show up at the house, forget us to sign, to get us signed some papers, and guess what? They were late, super late. We called and it's like, oh, we forgot. And I like to say it's happened one, only one time, you know, it's happened since we've been fixing up the house and everything, it's happened more than once. I will get more into that, but you know what? We're not going to. I'm not going to let it ruin my vibes. But guys, Patriot Cemetery. It's beautiful. I love this place. One day I might come up here and do my walking. We're about 27 miles from home, by the way. So it's not too far. And the road's on the way up here. I know I showed some of them. Oh God. <laughs> if you get motion sickness, it don't drive the roads, no. Of course the roads I showed on camera are in pretty good shape, but the ones we came through, no. All right guys, that's all I got, man. That's all I got. I'm gonna get some more road footage of, Ange, of us coming in. <laughs> And I'm going to walk way down out yonder, and she's going to meet me down there with the car. And, yeah, until next time, guys. Come on. Let's get out of here. Leave your comments. I love graveyards. I do. Do you? And I would have showed you more of this graveyard. Believe me, I would have loved to show tombstones, everything. Cemetery. Cemetery. I called it a graveyard, didn't I? I would love to show more, but... There was a dog that came in, and right now I think we're just biding our time because that dog can show his face anytime. And I got to get the tripod and me and Angie in the car. And before Stormy says hello, you want to fight? All right, guys, till next time, come on, let's get out of here.